Class is in session. Brittany, what are you doing? You better be studying. Okay, right now I'm teaching you how to get at least a 70 on this biology exam. And I should have started before this, but chapter 13 is long. And I don't think you want to go over chapter 13 again because I certainly at this moment don't want to go over chapter 13 again. Chapter 14 is easier and I can stop. Go to chapter 13 if I need to. So we're just gonna do this one. I guess you wonder where I've been. Yay! Starting on defining species. What am I doing? Speciation, the process by which one species splits into two or more species can be the same species they just go in the same so it's like human beings homo sapien homo sapien we create another homo sapien it can be like homo sapien homo erectus that's a hybrid god buy it okay. primary definition of species used in this book is called biological species concept and it defines that a species as a group of populations whose members have the potential to interbreed in nature and produce fertile offspring offsprings that can do the dirty do i'm gonna hate myself when i watch this back it doesn't really explain what it is the definition and how to define a species i guess it's talking mainly about like interbreeding in nature to produce fertile offspring i don't know stop it get some help oh ah! <gasps> my god that's what it is oh okay so they all define species i read this chapter at least three times and now i'm getting it this is why you need to study during thanksgiving break and not wait till sunday when your test is on monday a group of a a group of pop oh wait and then there is reproductive isolation which is a barrier there's a barrier that stops stops what what does it stop oh my god just a barrier that says, nah, fam, we ain't gonna let you mate or create viable, productive offspring. We gonna get into that later, Brittany. I got you. A hybrid, two distinct species coming together, do the do, they make a hybrid. And then they gave this like stupid picture of a growler bear, which is a grizzly bear, plus a polar bear. I don't know whose idea that was. This growler bear looked like it died within minutes. I don't even think it lived that long. And if it did live long, congratulations. Morphological species is based off of the physical traits. Yes. Chapter 14 has so many terms that it's going to be hard for this test. And who didn't put the homework up yet? My teacher. Here is where I've only memorized two out of the five for one and the three for the other one. I'm lacking. Prezygotic barriers, called prezygotic and postzygotic, because it happens in the formation of a zygote. Am I right? So postzygot, no. Prezygotic barriers are barriers that prevent an organism from creating a zygote so the types of isolation for prezygotic barriers the first one is habitat lack of opportunities to counter to encounter each other book gives an example of two different types of garter snakes Thamnophis atratus they live in water Thamnophis sertralis lives on land you live in that county however you can't go all the way to valdosta hours away but in the same state just to me i mean i would 
but I mean just to me habitat isolation temporal isolation just think about temperature eastern spotted skunk breeds in late winter best time western spotted skunk breeds in the fall if you breed in the winter you're not gonna change yourself to breed in the fall for no man Brittany, if you were just like wow i'm gonna make the do in the winter but like mainly the winters of january and then the man you know ethan dolan he is gonna be like nah fam nah nah i breed in the summertime you're not gonna change just to do it in the summertime temporal now behavioral what is this bird <laughs> wait till you see the f <laughs> behavioral is failure to send or receive appropriate signals oh it's kind of like mixed signals that some guys do the blue-footed booby huh, performs an elaborate courtship dance as do all people the masked booby performs a different courtship ritual so you're not gonna have like the max the max booby go up to the blue footed booby and be like and then she's just gonna be like ah, i don't what because she's used to you know the blue footed booby dance a peacock and they do that feather thing the lady can be like no and then like another male comes through and be like and then she's like i guess you wonder where i've been the mechanical is physical incompatibility of reproductive parts i'm just gonna think about it as like you don't have the same thing to make the thing like if i go up to like billy eilish and be like i'm having your baby you'd question it we'd all question it like how would that ha like and i'm like biologically i'm gonna have it and we're all just like no oh what is that i don't know what that word is i feel like it's gonna be on the test i don't know what that i'm just gonna read it allopatric speciation Sympatric. Oh, I think I'm gonna have to remember it. Uh, I wanna read it again. Okay, I'm just not gonna do that. I don't know what that means. I, it's the last part, so I guess I have to talk about it. Um, hybrid zones, and that's chapter 14. Chapter 15 is short ish at the same time. It's not. This is chapter 15. I don't like that. We're gonna do that tomorrow. Hope you do good on your test, Brittany. Please do good. We all know you have to take the final. You're not going to get a 90 by the end of this exam. But, I mean, to each its own, right? Just pass it.